Hi guys, and thanks for watching again. In this video I will be taking a look at this Volomov A1 magnetic USB charger with charge and discharge function. And it is mainly a charger which can charge a single lithium ion cell at a time. So there we go. Now, as we can see, it has a charge and discharge function. So I'm going to test that both. So let me get this aside. Is this a token or something? Oh, it just lists all the features on there. Max maximum charging, discharge current, one amp. And compatible with rechargeable lithium ion batteries. Automatically activate servo volt battery. Don't know what it means exactly, but I hope it means that it, uh, it uh, stops uh, charging or discharging uh, when uh, the battery is dead or discharging when the battery is nearly empty. And I hope that it does that at when it is at 3.7 volts and not with 0 volts. Um, with overcharge and over discharge protection and constant current and stable voltage charging mode. Don't know why that's a feature, but okay. And the reverse polarity protection. Well. That's nice, uh, because this one is, uh, the, the polarity is easy to fuck up with this one, so there we go, let's see, and uh, these, oh, these are quite, quite powerful magnets, so uh, let me see, this is a minus, and this is uh, one of the fake batteries from eBay I bought a while ago, so let's, uh, let's charge this, and uh, it's got positive and negative, so it is connected right now. Um, let me get this power bank. It is, uh, it is not, not empty, but it is also not uh, entirely full. So let me charge this. Um, there we are. Some green LED uh, starts flashing over there. And it's currently charging with 800, about 800. I don't know if you can see that on camera, but let me get that in focus. No, 700 milliamps for, and uh, 760. It is not very stable, but at least it is charging this battery. So uh, it's a good sign. And yeah, more normally when with normal devices, these, these batteries are not quite common uh, unless you get uh, flashlights like these, of course. And uh, it contains one single 18650 style battery like this one. And so, uh, so that's actually the reason I bought this device. I believe it was six euros or six dollars or something like that. So it, it is quite cheap and uh, it does charge a single cell. That is, uh, that's what I wanted it to do. Now, the, the fun thing about this is, is that it can also discharge or I can put this in here. And like, like you just saw, witnessed, now it is on. So it is currently powering this device from this battery. And when I put it on here, uh, it still lights. <laughs> uh, that's probably because now it is also in, in discharge mode. But when I put it in here, it, it has to to figure out that it, there, there's current going from there to there. And then it starts charging. But when I remove it, it, it actually turns off. Then it goes back into discharge mode. So that's that's what I'm suspecting which is going on in there. And there's a little dust particle in there. So let's let's discharge it. Let's see if that works. And uh, I don't think that this <laughs> this fake battery will last very long powering this <laughs> uh, rather powerful power bank. Um, so, but it is working. It is, uh, it is currently discharging. There's a blue LED on there. It is uh, discharging with 480 milliamp hours right now. And this one also says that there's powering power going in there. So yeah, this tiny device, it, it actually works perfectly <laughs> for this $6 or so. And it is powerful magnets. I can swing it around without the magnets even letting go. And uh, it is still discharging. Now, do we need to see the over the, uh, not the overcharge, but the, uh, the reverse polarity protection? We do want to see that, right? We do. So, uh, no bang, no smoke, <laughs> none whatsoever. So I hope when I reverse it, it still 
powers on. And it does. So it does have that protection and uh, no red LED or something which uh, indicates that it is brown. It just doesn't, just doesn't work. So this tiny little Folum of A1 charger, it, it works like a charm. And uh, I bought it from Banggood or so. Or so. They, they came with an email to me saying, uh, hey, you probably like this. And, uh, and I do. <laughs> I do like this. Now I'm able to charge batteries uh, for my one of my... Uh, most favorite uh, lanterns uh, which I most of the time use to to check on my beer how the fermenting is going on so uh, I need to charge batteries for these and then now I do have a charger I don't have to crack open a power bank and remove the battery from there or this one or something but I can use this device so yeah uh, I like it and uh, thanks for watching